Okay, guys, so I realized that lavender is something that I want a lot of in my backyard. I eventually want to surround my pool bottom part with it because it helps with the mosquitoes and fleas. Um, fleas tend to be a very big issue we have. They're um, annuals, so they'll come back every year. And um, However, the one or two that I started hasn't came up yet, so I'm going to try something else. I am going to do six. So I have these six containers that I'm going to fill up with soil. Now, again, this is the, the mix I always do. Um, it's just some regular potting or raised garden bed. I use both um, when I'm starting because I feel like a raised garden bed is kind of like a big pot, so I don't see there being much of a difference. However, I do add some um, pea moss and some perlite. Uh, let's see. This was actually garden soil for vegetable and herbs. I realized this morning that they were all miracle Grow Guys, um, I'm not affiliated with miracle Grow, and I don't um, say they're better than anybody. It just happens to be the ones that, um, for the perlite and peat moss, they were the, that was the only brand the big box store had when I went in. And for the garden soil, it was the cheapest one that they had when I went out there. So, all right, so I'm going to take these and... I'm going to head over to the counter and I'm going to show you what extra steps I'm doing with these ones versus the couple that I already tried that's still sitting there and I have nothing yet. Okay guys, so these are them. And what I'm going to do is I'm just not even going to try to control the seeds that come out of this. I mean... They're tiny. I know people may think that this is very wasteful, but like I said, I try to do the one or two and do the germination and it just wasn't working. So now I'm just going to go through and I'm just going to disturb the dirt it's on. Um, some of them may get covered, some of them may not. It's hard to tell. They're so little and they're black just like the soil okay so then I'm just gonna mist the top of the soil um, just enough to get it wet and this is going to be the last time the only time that I do it so what I'm thinking is I'm going to take these And I am going to cover them. See if I could do it with one hand. With a baggie. Kind of giving it that greenhouse effect to hold it in. Alright guys, so it's going to be too hard to do this with one hand, so I'm going to do all of them and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm going to do it like this. Now, um, if you noticed, I didn't put this one in there yet, because I am going to fill this with water. So, I have my container here, I'm ready to go water my other plants. Everything seems to be doing great with my water from the bottom. I had only started it once they were already germinated, but I'm finding like my peanuts, which would not germinate, did when I added them to the dish. For watering from the bottom. So since lavender has been giving me a hard time like the peanuts did, I'm going to try it this way and we're going to see what happens. Okay guys, so I'm going to start it in here. Um, this is the bottom shelf and I'm not too fond of the bottom shelf when it comes to germination. I feel like because it just stays cooler down here 
So um, if I have time today, I'm going to move some stuff around so I can move it to the top shelf. There's plenty of room down here, so maybe I'll just move the tote that's on the top shelf with the, um, or some of the bigger plants, I don't know. Get them down here to the bottom shelf and move these to the top. But for now, these are going to be down here. Maybe I'll throw in an extra light on them. Um, close the door, see what the temperature is in here. I don't know where. Let's see. Um, it is currently not quite, almost 80 degrees in here, so I guess it's not too bad. Um, I do want to move this down to the floor, though, so I could get a more accurate reading on the temperature. So I'll put that down here on my messy floor. I just can't wait to all my plants outside and get my office space back um i'll still be continuing to grow some plants but not all these all right guys see you on the flip side and be blessed